As per the U.S. Constitution, the religious freedom is the principle that grants us the privilege to follow any chosen religion, do worship according to our liking. Freedom of religion is protected by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution, which prohibits laws establishing a national religion or impeding the free exercise of religion for its citizens. Islamophobia is gripping Americans ever since Islamic terror groups attacked the World Trade Center in 2001. Due to this, the minority Muslim society in this country feels insecure and threatened. Average Muslim people have become victims of suspicions and religion-based hate crimes carried by anti-Semitic groups. Several anti-Semitic organizations operate in the United States, some of them are violent and racists who emphasize white supremacy. Tulsi believes that freedom of religion is an essential right conferred to every individual by our Constitution. As a veteran, she has vigorously fought for religious freedom and tolerance. Tulsi took a strong stand against anti-Semitism, Islamophobia, anti-Hindu, anti-Catholic, and other forms of hate in all its ugly forms. She is working actively to promote diversity, equality, and pluralism. She has spoken powerfully against the targeting of nominees and candidates for public office as well as for everyday Americans based on religion. She thunders that respecting the religious beliefs of others embodies the essence of Aloha. She is one of the millions of Hindus who have been targeted by discrimination and hate speech specifically for her personal religious beliefs. She stands firmly against anti-Semitism and has condemned its violence in the most potent ways. As a champion of religious freedom, she fought for religious tolerance and secularism. She has been recognized throughout the country by various religious communities for her actions. It's a high urgency call that we need to respond and support her in becoming the future president of our country to put an end to religious bigotry.